three bedrooms, perfect. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. What's Lord your budget Lord. like? Well, it's under communication. Yeah. Today we just went and walked around, uh, basically played the game of life, and essentially it was more of a actual real life focus, so everything from insurance to uh, cars, housing, furniture, and we all had to write it down and they gave us like our job and our marital status, our kids. Have a spouse yeah. and they don't have a job. I don't know they're where they're they see them. But if you have two that have to go to a daycare center or the nanny, then you have to look underneath the two column. Using all that information, we have to factor in everything that would pertain to living life. We got to learn how you're actually going to spend your money in the real world and how much everything really adds up very quickly. Furniture, for instance, is a lot more expensive than I thought it was going to be. And so I had to come back to that and I had to spend my money on priorities first, like transportation, housing, utilities, groceries. I was a vocational teacher and I did have some student loan debt, but fortunately for me, I'm single and um, I had no kids. So that made it a lot easier for me compared to other people that I heard were having trouble. You got housing, but you don't have health insurance for them. Somebody get sick. I know, she told me to go and Kim Evans, the Family and Consumer Science and Marketing Department Chair, brought the initiative to Hickory High School. I feel like it's um, one of those things that we don't realize um, is available for the city. The reality store is sponsored by the Virginia Cooperative Extension Program in partnership with Chesapeake 4-H, Virginia Tech, and Virginia State University. There was a lot of surprise looks today, especially when it came to them having multiple children and having to pay child care and realizing that both of the um, parents in the household um, have to work. The experiment even mimicked the unexpected surprises that can come with being an adult. So the crystal ball component is, um, it's the whole idea of chance. And so sometimes it's good and sometimes it's bad. Your brother gets laid off from work and his family is now going to live with you at 70. Nah. Um, so I'm about to graduate high school. I literally last night filled out like a student loan agreement thing. So this is very real world for me already. So it's nice to have this experience.